everyone today i'm reviewing the dm flash drive for iphones iphones and ipads uh this is a 64 gb flash drive so it can accommodate up to 64 gb data in this now uh this is the flash drive uh this is the carry case that it comes along with very nice thick material and it has strings at the top in order to close it and it comes with a manual which is very very self-explanatory uh, it tells you which application has to be installed and how we are supposed to use this flash drive now coming to the flash drive uh, at one end over here you will see uh, there's a cap you need to open it and this is for your usb where you can insert it into your laptop and over here this is the lightning connector which you need to connect to your iphone now i i always run out of the space in my phone since i have a 16 gb iphone and uh, I have to either delete the photos and videos or I have to transfer them and transfer transferring the photos to the laptop is a big time headache because I have to connect through a cable and then go to iTunes and copy and stuff. So this has saved a lot of time for me and the best thing is I can carry this along whenever I, I feel I'm running out of space just transfer the photos like in few minutes and you again have a lot of space back in your phone. Now how does this work now this is the iPhone. And first you need to first you need to install an app that is called DM Airplay. You can see that and you can install this from either if you are on Android Play Store or from the App Store. Now this is the lightning connector over here. So I'll just insert this. Okay. So it is asking that DM Airplay would like to communicate with DM Airplay. So I'll allow okay allow so now app is opening up it's loading the data now you have two options at the top so one is for the iphone and airplay right now the airplay is selected so we'll go for the iphone so this will give you all your data in your iphone so be it pictures movies music documents all files or camera now i want to transfer certain photos from my iphone to my flash drive so i'll select the photos option and uh, as you can see over here you have options so either you want the grid look or you want the straight look like the one you have it in your iphone so i'll go for the grid look and i'll select over here so say i want one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen okay and at the bottom you can see this arrow in the middle i'll press that it will give me option move to airplay or copy to airplay so moving to airplay will delete photos from my phone and copy will have the uh, photos in my phone also and also in the uh, flash drive so i'll say move to airplay so as you can see it's moving it's pretty fast and we are almost done okay now it is asking me whether should I delete from the phone or not? So I would say delete. That's completed. So from my phone, you won't see those pictures again. Now we'll go back and we'll go to the airplay option and we'll see the pictures. So these are the pictures we just moved. So this was pretty simple. Now uh, moving from your airplay, that is from your flash drive to your phone is also simple. For that, this is the main menu. Go to the airplay option. Now select, uh, say, movie. So I want to uh, move the first movie. So I'll say select. I'll select this movie and again I'll do this. Again, move to local or copy. So I say move to local. That's completed. Confirm. So now we'll check in the iPhone whether we have any movies or not. Yes, it is here. Now, one more thing that I liked about this is that I can play anything from the flash drive. So, uh, my daughter doesn't sit for long in the car seat when we go for the long drives. So, what I do now is that I back up some of the videos in this flash drive and I play it when she is bugged up. So, for that, you need to go to the airplay. Uh, I have movies. So, I have this Baba Black Sheep over here and it's almost 1 GB. So, I'll just select this and it will start playing. It's equivalent as if we are playing from your phone. So this is one of the good uh, thing that I liked about this. 
so basically you can use this as a proper flash drive to play movie songs and uh, in your uh, car with the help of the flash drive from the usb part so and to exit you just need to press this and you can exit from the airplay while removing this and uh, you can also as i said transfer data from computer to flash drive and to phone and uh, either or uh, vice versa very easily and very quickly so overall this is a very good asset and this is a very good asset for me because i love taking pictures i love taking videos and since i don't have much memory space in my phone this is a real good backup so it's a good device it's really good for the price and the best it stores your all your photos and videos so that you don't need to delete them overall very very good and i would really recommend it thank you so much